am Maria King, and I am running a marathon in partnership with GNC. And I want to share with you a few tips that I have because you know what? I've been putting 25 to 30 miles on these joints every single week for the last month. And one of the things that has helped me recover is not only taking my supplements and resting, but stretching. So let me show you my three to four favorite stretching exercises starting with my quads. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab the back of my foot, making sure that my knee is pointing straight downward. Now if you can't do that, you can hold on to something. But make sure your core is tight so you don't fall over. So you should feel a stretch right there in the front of your thigh and uh, hold that for about 15 seconds at minimum. A second stretch that I love is the hamstrings. Now I'm gonna dig my heel to the ground and I'm gonna reach down and feel that stretch right in the back of my leg. Sometimes I like to add a little bit of a bounce, only because I can get a little bit deeper every single time. I have to be honest, this stretch hurts. And it hurts because as many of you guys know, I injured my right knee and you'll often see me wearing a brace whenever I run. So that is why I'm really big on making sure that I get my stretching in. Something that I've been honestly very neglectful about in my past years of training. So here is a foam roller. Let me show you the magic from whirling. I'm going to go ahead and lay my thigh right on top of it, making sure that I'm secured, and I'm going to roll up and down this foam roller. Ow! You should feel a little bit of pain because that is the IT band. The IT band is something that gets tight whether you're running 2 miles a week or 25 miles a week, so you got to make sure you're stretching that out. Now you can also turn over and do the back of your leg. I like to say that this is like getting a massage but not having to pay for a massage therapist. So you can do the back of your leg. You can even do your calf. So you know that gets tight. It's all about putting a little bit of pressure onto that foam roller and kneading, kneading that muscle. <sighs> okay, now I already feel relaxed. So those are some, these are some of my favorite stretching exercises for all of you. You know, it isn't easy to do anything, whether it's running a marathon or stay committed to any fitness program, but it's really important to not only do cardio training and strength training, but you might need the flexibility training too. So thanks for watching everyone. I'm Maria Kang, signing out.